Hey everybody, welcome to another Rant Time with Klaus, and this time Rantopolis is visited by Mario Fengol 93! Hi guys! Okay, this is something we were not happy about this, something that really pisses us off. This really, really grinds my <sighs> gears like you just wouldn't believe. You just pissed me the fuck off. I'm not happy for what I've heard. Yeah, the topic this time around is by a motherfucking pastor, Steven fucking Anderson. Yep. Okay. The reason why we are gonna do a rant on with this asshole Steven Anderson because after we, because we were first heard of this guy when after we watched one of the uh, videos from Alpha Omega Sin, and we decided to do a rant on this asshole from ourselves. Yeah, exactly. I could, Alpha Omega Sin, you're one, you're one, you're you're one awesome dude. The link of the uh, link to his video will be in the description field down below because I feel like he covers this. Much better than I can even hope to. Yeah. Yeah, Alpha Omega Sin is awesome. I really enjoy his rants. Not just that, but he also does the... Some other games. It does gaming and yeah, stuff. Yeah, on point. Sort of recently, Steven Anderson just went, uh, just went out of the woodwork and just like... Saying like... The, the terrorist attack on Paris? Should have been expected. He thinks it was warranted for uh, for just just the stupidest oh. fucking reason. Yeah, exactly. Now, before you're gonna get you on, know, say something to um Stephen like, about France deserved um people from France who deserve to die. I just wanted to say first of all, Stephen, what the fuck is wrong with you? Clearly, he lacks a brain. Exactly. I mean, this guy is such an asshole or something. I, I can't stand him. Why the fuck did he say that? That the attack was warranted? Apparently, they were okay with adultery. Yeah. Fucking adultery! <sighs> yeah! <sighs> oh my god. Now, um, saying that people deserve France by terrorists and have shootings from terrorists and saying that they deserve to die? Are you fucking kidding me? Are you serious? Stephen, you are, you are one fucked up person. That is so disgraceful. Like Alpha Omega Simpson. He's, that the, the thing he said is disgusting. Absolutely so disgusting. disgusting. Sick to my stomach. And it, it, it makes me more so that you just went out and said this with a straight fucking face. And yes. Fact, you think you can justify their death? You need to be ashamed of yourself. Oh God. I even made a me verse post saying nine <sighs> times out of ten okay. are outright awful. Yeah, I mean it's really. It's really disgusting. I um, think bad things. The people from Paris, just because they got killed in a like, terrorist attack, it's really, it's really a disgrace. Like, it, it is a disgrace. I always support the French people. So do I. Wherever they, wherever they're in danger. Okay, I, let, let me just ask them. Like, okay, they're okay with it all three. How the fuck is it hurting you? Like, oh, oh, the body pull isn't it? 
Fuck the Bible. It's a bunch of bullshit. <sighs> really fucking bullshit. <sighs> and here's another topic about what Steven Anderson is about. It's about death metal bands. Now, here's... Now, this point is about this is because he said that dead metal fans should die. Really, Steven? So you're really? Saying, it, even it, saying that saying that death metal it, it's because they're they live, they should have get to death or something. Okay, so what you're saying? Are you is fucking that kidding me? Fellow death metal fans, like any any kind of metal at all. You could be, um, thrash metal, uh, let's see, you could be, um, death metal, you could be standard metal, like, any kind of metal at all. Anyone who's a fan of that, Al Megasin, my girlfriend yeah. and I, you th think we should all die? Just because we love death metal? <sighs> my god, even. What the fuck is your problem? Just because, you should die just because we're into... Some kind of death metal here. I mean, it's it's a death metal is a good type of music. If um if they don't like you because they're sensitive, it's fine. However, when you said it that it's something that is go too far, saying that should die, then that's your fucking problem. And it's it's not okay that you think you can dictate what the fuck we consume, what the fuck we listen to, and what the fuck we buy, what the fuck we just enjoy the in, in general like okay this is what you're okay to be into this is what's not okay for me into and nine times out of ten it's metal you know you have something exactly to with pat, pat robertson I, i'm sure i don't need to bring this up but i'm just going to anyway remember that at one point pat robertson said that 9 11 happened because of homosexuals Do you think you should talk about uh, Al Robertson on your solo rant in the future? I probably will, but more to the point, you and him have something both in common. You're both okay. a you're, you're both a couple of fucking nutcases. Exactly, and here's something we got to point this out about the death metal one. This is where he talks about one of the. This is from the group Eagles of Death Metal. The lead singer was Jesse Hughes, and something worse. What did? Okay, here's what Steven said to Jesse. Here, just because he's wearing he's wearing pink pants, he called him a drug pushing hillbilly faggot. It, 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 that's his exact quote. Drug pushing. Hillbilly faggot. Like what? Just because he makes a couple drug references in his song? You know, the 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 very music you cherry pick bits and pieces of to support your bullshit argument. That's that's something that's not okay. I mean, how is cherry picking is acceptable on any kind of debate format? And here's what I have to say about Stephen saying that what he called that lead singer is because he wears pink pants. Okay, just because he wears pink pants doesn't mean he's fucking gay. What the fuck is going on with you, Steve? Let's get this perfectly fucking straight, Mr. Anderson. Pink pants? So what the fuck? Eh? He's wearing pink pants. What the fuck ever? Okay. It's a color of fabric. Nothing more than that. A guy wearing pink does not mean he's gay. Does not mean he's homosexual. Doesn't mean anything. Look, I'm wearing black right now. Okay? Does that mean I'm a Satanist? No. Yeah, I mean, um, and most time I wear black t-shirts and, and whatever I Whereas when he has dark teeth, does that make me a lesbian? No! I can wear any, can wear any type of shirts I want! And at the end of the day, it means nothing. 
Okay, our clothing color, our co uh, no. clothing designs. It all it is is our preference at the end of the day, and that's it. Yeah, and that is about it. Can't stand this the guy. Way people take these fucking ideologues seriously it just makes me sick to my stomach. Same here. <sighs> what else? I think that was pretty much about it. Okay. Yeah, it's pretty much all we have to say about um, S Stephen Anderson saying, um, God already got our points about um, Grant deserved a terrorist, uh, deserved the terrorist attack just because they got killed, which is totally disgraceful and disgusting. And it's, and saying, and another topic saying that death metal fans should die. Which is like way far. I mean, it's it's that guy is, is totally it's sick. A way out of, He's a total it's sick. A way out of line, and it just completely retarded. It just it's dishonest, is what it is. Yeah. Okay. Last thing I have to say to you, Stephen Anderson. And that's all I have. To go fuck yourself and shove your ideology right up your fucking ass. Yeah, devil, fucking you, shove it right up to your fucking ass. Okay. There's no way, no way at all, you can justify the death of. Thousands of innocent people caused by the caused by fucking ISIS. This is that's what pisses me off even more. That ideology is. We may or may not do a rant on ISIS itself. Yeah. It's pretty much all we got. Uh, that's. All we have to say at, the, at, the, at this given time. <laughs> That's all we have to say at this given time. That's. I don't, I don't see anything else to say that presumably Inwells hasn't said before. Nothing that Elf Mega Sin hasn't said before. So I guess that wrap. So I guess that wraps things up. Yep. And Alpha Omega Sin, I. You know, a bunch of subscribers are here to say this. Thank you so much for bringing up this topic about this asshole here. You're awesome. And thank you, Alpha Megasin, for our, all the fresh quality content that you've shelved out over the years. You bring so many interesting points to the table that you brought things to me. If you brought things to light to me that I wouldn't have known otherwise, like Anita Sarkeesian, for example, and this asshole. Mm -hmm. So I guess um, that wraps it. <laughs> that wraps things up. Thank you so much for watching. This has been Klaus and my thank on my three. We'll see you another time. Peace out. And Bye. One more time. One more time, Steven Anderson. Fuck yourself. <laughs>